Hello everyone! Today, we will show you the 5 habits to achieve high academic performance. Do you feel unmotivated lately? Unproductive? But do you want to achieve this? Let us be inspired by Ms. Renaline, the top STEM student of 2020. A top college student also of PS in computer science with a GWA of 1.0454. Ms. Renaline shared her five habits. So let's start with habit number one. Create a checklist of tasks you need to do. According to her, in my phone, I have checklists which I monitor every day in order to remind me of the things I still need to do. This helps me organize my tasks and know what requirements are still pending for submission. Habit number two, create your own notes. She said, even if there are already handouts given, I still try to create my own notes and summary for a better retention of concepts. Expressing ideas in your own words or formatting it according to how you will understand it better is really helpful in effective learning. Also, during exams, it will be easier to scan through the notes than reading again all the information in the modules. <music> Habit number three, take care of yourself. She said, Find time to meet with friends, take a walk, play a game, watch series, or do anything that will help get rid of those that stresses us out. We also need to take a break, refresh, and reward ourselves for being productive. Thus, this can also be a source of motivation for us to achieve our goals. Habit number four, make time for your hobbies or any stress reliever activities. According to Ms. Renaline, don't forget to eat on time, exercise, and get a good sleep to keep our physical and mental well-being active and healthy. We will not be able to function effectively in our health if our health is already at risk. So it is also important to take a rest and refuel while studying. Before we continue to habit number five, let me share this quote that I read from Atomic Habit of James Clear. Habits are the compound interest of self-improvement. Getting 1% better every day counts for a lot in the long run. If you want a better result, then forget about getting setting goals. Focus on your system instead. Okay, let us now continue. Habit number five. Look for other resources. According to her, when you don't understand something, there are other resources online which can help you have a better comprehension of the topic. Also, it is okay to ask for help from teachers and peers whenever we find it hard to understand the concept. Sometimes, we just need a different point of view or wordings from other people in, it, in order to understand it. 
to Miss Renaline. Here's a message from your friend. Ain't best girl. Renaline is an achiever and a good friend. Academically, she is competitive and goal-oriented. She strives to always do her best in anything she is tasked to do. She is also a good friend. She is thoughtful and trustworthy. She is a friend you can always rely on. She will always listen and supports you in any circumstances you are on. Ain is a person who inspires others to do their best. This message is from me. Thank you so much, Miss Renaline. To everyone, thank you for watching. If this video inspires you, press the like button and don't forget to subscribe. See you next time. God bless.